An 18 year old University of North Florida student in Jacksonville was arrested early today after police say he fired a gun inside his dorm room during an argument. Police say the incident happened on the third floor of the V building of Osprey Cove sometime around midnight. First Coast News reporter Brittany Dion joins us live now with the latest on this. Well, Jeannie, the fall semester here at UNF just started less than two weeks ago, and now the suspect, a freshman here at UNF, is said to have pointed a gun at a female student, and according to police said, I'll light this expletive up. University of North Florida students trying to make sense of a senseless act. I didn't want to go outside. It's crazy. 18 year old freshman Cameron James Daniel is charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon without the intent to kill. University police report Daniel fired a single shot into the ceiling of his campus dorm room. The terrifying ordeal happened at the Osprey Cove dormitory just after midnight Friday morning. This university police report says five students, including Daniel, were inside of dorm room V312 when the suspect got into a heated argument with his roommate and two other female students. It all started when one of the girls complained she was afraid of the suspect's girlfriend who was playing with the taser. Daniel then pointed a gun and according to the report said, quote, I'm going to light this expletive up. Do you ever feel unsafe on campus or? Never. Police. Turn off the alarms, everyone was everyone was fine. Do you ever feel like you're in danger or anything inside of the dorms? I mean, this is that was the first time I was actually kind of startled. This was also the first time this parent coming to pick up her son heard about the incident. Right now I want to throw up, to be honest with you. Really? Yeah, because this is the stuff that you kind of, you know, get scared of. You hear it all the time, but you don't think it's going to hit you. This student says this is a learning opportunity for everyone. We know that it probably won't happen again because other people are going to look at it and say, this is what happened to him. I'm not letting that happen to me. Now, fortunately, no one was injured in this incident. I did speak to campus officials to find out the future of the suspect here on campus. I'll tell you what they have to say coming up on First Coast News at 6. Reporting live from UNF, I'm Brittany Dion, First Coast News.